Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm just going to try to create a look and see what happens and go with the flow. I already primed my face, so I'm already prepped and ready. And if you want to know what I primed my face with, it was this hard, I don't know if you can see this, hard candy. Uh, prime, lift and firm, moisturizing, brightness and tightness, facial conditioning. I think it's pretty good. The only thing I don't recommend for it is because I don't like the way it smells. It works pretty good and everything, but the smell just can't do it. I just can't do it. So, to start the look off, I'm probably going to end up having to do my um, eyeshadow. So, we're going to just go with a really bold look today because the bolder, the better type thing. And I'm just going to go in right now with a this palette that I got at Walmart like two Christmases ago so it's whatever <laughs> I'm surprised I still have it um the, it's really pigmented like I love the pigment tints in it like I'm gonna go in with this brown right here um into my crease so I'm gonna work that into my crease That's what we're going to do first. We're just going to work this into our crease. Ignore all the other faces I'm about to make. So then I'm going to just get that some more and just work this into this side, into the crease. Okay. Mood. And then I'm going to take this purple right here and I'm just work that in all on the side so, working that in taking the purple working that in Then, I'm going to take this blue, right here, and then I'm just going to go on the outer of my eyes, I'm just going to work that in. I want to clarify, I am no makeup professional. I love makeup, but I am no professional at this. Anything I'm doing, I'm not a professional at this. So I'm probably going to get a lot of the things wrong. And that's okay because it's all about learning and experiencing and seeing how stuff goes and playing it out. So that's what I'm doing. I'm learning and I'm experiencing. I'm just going with the flow and seeing how things work out for me. So next thing I'm going to do is find my concealer, which is right here, and put it into right here on my eyelid eyes lid there we go sorry i can't talk okay so i'm just gonna grab that just a little bit and then just work that in right here work it in work that in mm -hmm. gotta keep tapping it until it's not too pasty but it's good so we're just going to work that into the eye. And so, alright, we're going to take that off. We're going to take full spectrum and urban decay. That's where it's from. We're going to just take the same brush we're using, which is a concealer and foundation. But I used it so much it doesn't have large spots anymore and we're just gonna take this mm, color right here oh yeah i broke my mirror because i dropped it and we're just gonna just go dig into it 
Let me apply that right on the lid. Yeah. Right there. And so after we apply this right onto our lid, we're going to do the same thing with the other side. So I'm going to grab the concealer that I just dropped because I'm a dumb cuss. And I'm going to just apply that in the same area. Okay. And then we're just going to take our handy dandy finger and just tap it. Mm, tap it, tap it. Honestly, anybody can create your own style and your own look. Just don't be afraid to do so. And so we're just tapping this. Okay. Then we are gonna take the same color, dig into the freaking thing, and then just apply all here. Okay, so basically, I know it looks kind of crazy. I'm very aware of that. But we're gonna dust the brush off, go back in with this brush, and we're gonna go with the darker in right here. So we're gonna clip that. And then we're gonna go in on the ends of our look, and we're just gonna press that into the look. I know it looks very, very wild, trust me. So we're just pressing that into the look. Okay. So then we're going to go in to the other side and just press that into the look. Okay, we're just still pressing that into the look, pulling that out. Why? So, I have a blending brush. If I can find it. Yeah, I got a blending brush, so we're just going to blend that, these parts right here, so it's not too loud, into the inner part of our eyes. Okay. So then from here, we need to do our eyeliner. So we're going to use our foundation. We're going to find a eyeliner. Struggle of having a lot of makeup. Just trying to find your makeup. And it's just not a good need, honestly. It's really annoying. Like, you have no idea. It's so annoying just to find good makeup. I think to find your makeup in general. And, like, I'm the type of person that put everything in, like, one area. And, like, I have all my makeup in, like, one box. And then I have to figure out how the heck this got there or where does this go. And everything like that. And it's honestly so stressful. So we're going to go in with a white liner. Because I'm feeling kind of bold today. Alright, make sure that shows up. So we're going in. We're going in. Alright, so we went in. We got the white liner going across. Just gonna scrape the texture of this off. So we went down both sides and make sure I get here and here. Okay, so after I go in on both sides, make sure I still need to light. Mm -hmm. There we go. Go there on both sides. I'm going to now here's the fun part. 
So I get to like dabble and try things out and figure out if I like or what I don't like. I'm gonna take this purple with where's my brush? Um this is the thing I was talking about. I'm very disorganized. Ah, with this brush, and I'm just gonna open the purple. This is my little sister. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? Uh, I'm recording a video because I had a camera back. I mean, hi to people on uh, YouTube, yeah. not camera. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Goodbye. Mm -hmm. Get out so I can finish recording the video. So I'm going to take some purple. Riri, get out. <laughs> I'll just apply okay. it. Oh. Right in here. Okay, so we're just gonna apply this all here. <laughs> Riri, I still see you. I'm gonna cover my eyebrow. If this covers, we'll see in a second. I honestly don't know. I'm gonna try to cover my eyebrow. I'm just gonna keep applying it. So this is gonna apply, apply, apply. I'm covering the whole face. So ah, it's covered. I'm just applying. I'm gonna need more all here. So I'm going in with multiple colors because this is a multiple color type of look. But I'm just gonna apply ah a uh, code, a uh, ho code, all down here, all here. Okay, so applying, applying, applying. Obviously, I have to get my ears. I got a big goop of just paint all in my ear. Look, it feels so weird. Just painting my ear. This is normal. So normal. We are monsters. We are cool. Okay, go around here. We will have to go. Underneath here, we get all that. Okay, and so we're gonna keep painting. Okay, keep painting. All right. Sadly, I have to paint my mouth. It's a mood. Okay, I don't know why this is showing up blue because this is purple, but it's showing up blue to y'all. So this is very intriguing. I have to paint this ear and not down the paint. Now this is clearly purple, but on here it shows it as a blue, which is weird. So I wonder what blue is. Hmm. I'll figure it out. Okay, so we're just gonna keep applying this all everywhere. I'm covering all here with black, so we're still just going to go in with the purple. Ah, I got my nose. I'm being a little butt hurt. Okay, so I'm coming in with the purple. I'm gonna have to go over my lips with the actual color, so I'm just gonna blow it out for now. 
And we're just going to keep going in with the purple. Okay. Okay, the base coat is now about complete. Okay. So we, the base coat of the purple is done. So now we're just going to go in with the blue into like some spots. So we're just going to take the blue and apply it here. I'm just going to apply this in some areas. So then I'm going to close that. And we're going to add a purplish color. Well, this is like a pinkish color, not purple, but same thing. Same thing. We're just going to add the colors in with this. Just going to add one of the colors at a time. Oh, that's a 